Hello everybody, welcome back to another Mid-Journey version 5 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to teach you a few things. First off, I'm going to show you how to create images or photos in the style of any photographer you like. As long as they've been cataloged, they're go you can create images in their style. Not only that, I'm going to give you access and show you how to use the Mid-Journey version 5 photographer's reference sheet. This has over 370 of the best photographers of all time in here. And I'm going to show you how to use them so that you can create images in their style. So creating your own images from scratch in Midjourney. The second thing I'm going to show you is I'm going to show you how to take an image that you've already taken, either your own image or maybe a stock image for that matter, how to upload it into Midjourney and then apply the style to that image after. So you could take a generic and I'll show you here. I'll give you an example. I've got this simple version of this lady doing yoga. I got a white lady here, attractive lady doing yoga. And then we go ahead and we apply styles to it. And you'll see here that we apply this sort of nighty, uh, night lighty Brandon Wolfel style to it. So I'm going to show you how to do that. We also did it with this version here where we took this lady and then we applied a style to it after. So I'm going to show you both of those things, and then I'm going to give you, uh, show you a little bit of, of the reference uh, list so you can see what's in there. So let's just get going. This is very easy to do. It should take only a couple minutes at most. First thing you want to do is you want to go ahead, and if you want to create an image in another photographer's style, very easy to do. Just go forward slash imagine when you're in the prompt here, and then you go uh, lady reading a book, for example, and then here's the important part, part of me, in the style of and then we need to use the particular photographer. So if I go back to my reference sheet here, you'll see here that I've selected Brandon Wolfel because I kind of like the nice, you know, night light type, bright type look that they've got going on here. They get the nice bouquet, etc. So I'm going to go ahead and use him as an example. But of course, you can go through this and use any of the 370 photographers here or any other ones for that matter that you want to. So here we go. Going back into Discord. So I'm going to go in the style of Brandon Wolfel and I'm going to hit enter. While I do that, I'm going to show you the second technique where we take an image from our computer or from your phone or whatever it is, or you can just use a stock image and apply a style to it. So I'm going to go into my finder here and I'm going to grab this image here. And I've got this image of that of that Asian lady here and she's reading or she's looking at her phone at night. So I'm going to drag and drop it in there and then I hit enter like I just did there. And I've gone ahead and uploaded the image and it's now in mid-journey. Beautiful. I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to now go and copy the link. That's very important. Next step. Well, look at that. I can already tell that this image is going to be awesome. I'm going to go forward slash imagine. And then I'm just going to go command V on a Mac, control V on a PC. And I'm going to copy that link that we just copied. So I'm putting that in there and I've pasted it in. So I've pasted in the link and now... All you got to do is go in the style of Brandon Wolfel. Let me make sure I spell that right. And then hit enter. And when it does that, it's going to take the image that we uploaded here, which is this one. And it's now going to apply the stylization to that image while we wait. So while we wait for that one, let's take a look at the image that we generated. Lady reading a book in the style of Brandon Wolfel. Click on that and look at that. This is fantastic. If we go, I mean, these are just beautiful images, but if we go over to Google Chrome here and we look at the styling that Brandon Wolfel is known for, just take a look, especially at these ones over here on the right side here, the sort of street art look here. This is exactly what we've got in Mid Journey, if you ask me. We have a perf near perfect, just amazing how good Mid Journey's gotten. I mean, I don't even know, I don't even have words for it. So there we go. We've gone ahead and we've done that. That was the first one where we we generated our own image. Now we're going to look at the uh, second style where we uploaded our own image. Then we copied and pasted in the link and then we applied the style after. Let's click and see what we got here. So we've got this lady and she's got the nice cool night lights going on here with the bright lights. Yeah, you know what? It has done a very, very, very good job. If we click out of that and we go look at the original image, it's just a lady here with none of that lighting. And now the lighting is there. So this, in a nutshell, is how you can basically use any photographer's style. And again, we're not stealing it. We're just kind of, you know, we're, we're, we've are we gone, instead of having to take, you know, an image in a, in a studio and we, you know, holding for lighting and angle and all that stuff, we can just sort of borrow it, <laughs> for lack of a better word, 
and apply it to our images. And it has done a great job. So I'm going to put a link to all of this in the description below, including this reference sheet here. If you have any questions or if you get stuck at any point, of course, just let me know. And uh, that's it for this one. Thanks for watching.